Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name's Ken. Today's experiment is shattering a marble. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is a glass marble, a stove, a cup of water, tongs, and a frying pan. Some safety precautions. Perform only under adult supervision. Wear safety goggles. Exercise caution using a stove. And the marble will be very hot for several minutes after it's placed in water. So uh, to set up this experiment, set your stove on high for 10 minutes, put a frying pan on it, and put your marbles in the frying pan. And then uh, just wait, kick back, and when the time's up, take a, a mitten or a glove and pull your uh, frying pan off the heated uh, part of the stove there, and then take your tongs and take your marbles and place them in a cup of water. Um, it's just regular tap water. It doesn't have to be freezing cold, though I will try that later. Um, and you can see that um, the water is, uh, the marble so hot that it's actually uh, warming the water right now, um, which is pretty cool itself. Um, and then go ahead and drop the rest of your marbles in. Um, and you'll see that there's two of them there. I'm trying to spin it around for you. Um, and you can see that it is shattered uh, just like that, right? So I will tell you the science behind it in just a minute. And so we put the third marble in, and now you're going to let it sit in the cup for several minutes so it could completely cool down. The marbles are going to stay hot for a very long time. So um, give it a couple minutes, um, maybe three or four, and then take them out again with the tongs and put them in the cup. And you, you will see that these marbles are shattered in the inside, which is pretty crazy. So they didn't shatter all the way into pieces, but they did shatter inside, and I'll tell you the science behind that. All right, so the science behind this. Uh, so when the marble is heated, it expands. We don't really see that, but when it's cooled, it contracts. Um, if it contracts too rapidly, it will shatter. And so uh, this is why it's not a good idea to put water on hot piece of glassware because it will crack, right? And we've all probably done that before. Since the marble is spherical, it contracts equally in all directions, shattering the inside of the marble while retaining the spherical shape, which is pretty awesome. And you can see here, it's all cracked on the inside, but it's still maintaining uh, the marble itself, which is really cool. So I just kind of put before after afters. Here's the marble on the left, what it looked like. And then after I got done expanding it with the heat and then cooling it, and uh, you can see that it's shattered on the inside uh, with both different marbles, the smaller ones. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to take a larger marble and see what we can do with that. So same thing. I put it on for 10 minutes, and uh, the larger marble is sitting there. You can't see it expanding. We know it's expanding. 10 minutes is up. And now I'm going to uh, turn it off and move it off the hot part of the stove and then take my tongs and put it in uh, cold water. And so once I put it in cold water, you're going to probably see instantaneously it shatters right there. The black is just from the, the part of the pan there. But it shattered all the way, so it's pretty cool. Um, on the same same results, larger marble, um, it kind of went a little bit better. Um, you can see this the the water steaming up in the inside, and then when we take it out, we're going to see a closer look um, where it's all shattered on the inside, where it was very clear before. Um, so that's pretty cool. I did try to take ice ice cold water and see if I could actually crack it or shatter it in pieces. Um, but that didn't work. I got the same results. So no matter how cold the water was, I could not get it to break um, on there. But I thought it would be a, a, a challenge to do. So I gave it a shot and it didn't work. Anyway, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Remember to click thumbs up and to subscribe. And thanks for watching.